Okay, welcome everyone. Um, thank you for tuning in to this very brief video where I'll be introducing my upcoming online meditation program, Embracing Change, Meeting Impermanence with Grace and Compassion. This is an online meditation program running from March 1st to April 26th. It's a nine week program. So throughout this video, I'll be offering uh, just a little bit of an explanation about what we'll be doing in this program and how the program might unfold for us. So just a little bit about myself. My name is Christopher Luard. I'm a longtime meditation practitioner. I've been practicing for about 36 years. I've studied very deeply and practiced very deeply in both the Mahayana Buddhist tradition and the Theravada Buddhist traditions. I've also trained a bit, about three years or so, in uh, Vedanta Hinduism. I'm also uh, well-trained and studied and certified in trauma-sensitive mindfulness neuroplasticity, and nonviolent communication. So I'll be bringing all of that to the table throughout this nine-week course so that we might come to a place where we can indeed embrace change and impermanence with grace and compassion. So I'm just running through the slides here. So here's a quote from the Buddha. And I think this really uh, underscores the importance of these very, very profound practices around change and impermanence. All compounded things are impermanent. They will arise and fall. Once they have arisen, then they fall away. Being free within this is the highest happiness. That was the Buddha from the Mahaparinibbana Sutta. Beautiful. So that's the idea of this nine week program, finding that highest happiness within the ever changing field of reality that we find ourselves in. So just a little bit of an outline of the course, and this is the way it stands so far. Uh, this may change more or less, but this is kind of the idea of how things will unfold. The reason why I like to maintain some flexibility with that is I do like to meet the retreat participants where they're at and try to shape the course according to what's coming up for people on the course. But loosely, this is the outline that we'll be following over the nine weeks. For the first three weeks, we'll be practicing very deeply mindfulness, drawing from what's known in the Buddhist tradition as the four foundations of mindfulness. But we'll be using those four foundations of mindfulness to really examine the ever-changing field of impermanence that we live within. In week four, we bring that cultivated, heightened sense of awareness of change to the changes in the physical world, this beautiful planet, Mother Gaia, that's going through so much change right now. Then week five, we bring that heightened sense of awareness that we cultivate in mindfulness to the changes in our body. Week six, seven, and eight, we bring that awareness, that attention to the changes that we might be experiencing in our own thinking mind, in our thoughts, our feelings, our memories, really our sense of who we are and how that changes over the course of a lifetime. And then week nine, we bring it all together and rest in that quality of freedom within the ever-changing sands of time. So this is really just one part of a series of three intensive courses. This nine-week program is a program on embracing change and impermanence. 
when this concludes, I'll probably take about a month or maybe six weeks off. Then I'll be opening another course around the topic of emptiness or no self. And I'm right now in the process of wrapping up a course called Awakened Living, which is around suffering and the end of suffering. So th these three courses are based on the, the, what's known in the Buddhist tradition anyway as the three marks of existence. All living beings encounter and have all three of these qualities within them, right? We're all in the midst of change all of the time. We're all have some quality of struggle in our lives. All human beings do. It's just part of being human. And we're all something of a non-self. Now that might sound a little bit ambiguous. Don't worry about that now. It really doesn't. Uh, it's not important to understand non-self to get the full benefit of the course of embracing change. But if you're curious about non-self, that's coming up probably nearer to the fall or the winter if you live in the Americas, North America and so forth. Okay. I guess I could put a month on that. Maybe emptiness, non-self will be around September or October. So this is the, the, the structure. It's really a year program. Now you don't have had to take one before you take the other. They're not, they don't consecutively unfold in that way. Uh, and so if you're new to these programs or if you're new to meditation in general, you're still gonna get wonderful benefit from signing up for this Embracing Change course. So here is the outline. Here is the, the meeting structure, I should say. Uh, there are two sections of the Embracing Change course. Section one uh, is offered from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. East Coast time on Tuesday evenings. And Section two is 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. on Wednesday mornings, East Coast time. That's 1 p.m. in the UK. So just to make note here that shortly after this course launches, there is a time change. And so when that time change occurs, it will move from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. East Coast time or 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. Uh, in the morning on Wednesday morning. So just to make note of that, that that's there on the horizon. So the meetings will happen once a week for three hours. There'll be a 20 minute break in the meeting there because three hours is a long time. So it's divided quite evenly, about an hour and 20 minutes, then a 20 minute break, then another hour and 20 minutes. Uh, we'll be exploring breakout groups so that people can uh, leave the group and discuss the topics on their own amongst each other. There's also an invitation to join study pods that will meet uh, once a week outside of the retreat on your own time so that you can again get together on your own and go over the material, engage with the material and the practices together and so forth like that. So to kind of sum it up here, the course Embracing Change, Meeting Impermanence with Grace and Compassion. This is a nine week online meditation program. It runs March 1st to April 26th. Section one, 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. East Coast time on Tuesdays. Section two, 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Wednesdays. East Coast time, which was, is 1 p.m. UK time. Please do be aware of the time change and factor that in. Uh, I live in Thailand where the clocks don't change year round. So for me, the times will remain the same. So for people who live elsewhere, the times will change accordingly. All of the sessions are recorded over Zoom, just like this is being recorded over Zoom. And so if you feel like nine weeks meeting once a week is a big commitment, you don't want to commit to meeting all nine weeks, 
that's absolutely fine. There's no reason you should have to do that. In fact, many of the retreat participants uh, sign up for the retreat and do it all on their own time, in their own pace. You're more than welcome to do that. In fact, you could still do that and take part in the study groups if you wish. Now the study groups are optional. So even if you just do the online course, the study groups are optional. You don't have to take part in that if you don't want. So there's a lot of flexibility around the structure here. You can do all of it live, some of it live or none of it live. It's completely up to you. There will be a Facebook community page uh, for the course. So even if you don't do the live sessions, you can still interact with the community that's forming online. The whole package includes one-on-one -on -one sessions with me throughout the entire nine-week program. If you feel that's supportive for you, uh, you can schedule an appointment for me and we'll meet one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, there'll be plenty of guided meditations to move us through the processes of change and impermanence. Uh, again, I, I mentioned the community. And so one of the great benefits of this online setting is we can meet each other from all over the world and come together to really engage in these very deep and profound practices together. There's plenty of opportunity for question and answer. There's about 40 minutes allotted for Q&A each session, roughly 30 to 40 minutes. So plenty of time to have any questions that are coming up addressed and spoken to. This course and everything I offer is offered in a trauma sensitive framework. For me, that's quite important and it's offered in a secular voice. Although my training has been mostly in the Buddhist traditions, I won't be drawing upon any religion. So you don't have to come from any one particular belief system to receive great benefit from this. I'm actually very passionate about bringing these teachings to the world in a non-denominational voice. The bottom line, the whole program costs 99 US dollars. You can register now. Registration is open on my website, suchsweetthunder.org, or you could simply send me an email if you're re ready to register, chrisluard at yahoo.com. All of the information is here on the slide at the bottom of the screen there. So, Hope to see you all on the retreat. Thanks again for tuning in. Uh, please do message me if you have any other questions about the retreat program and uh, hope to see you there. Thank you so much.